as Hispanic and Latino Heritage Month begins, Pam and I want to invite Virginians across the Commonwealth to join us in celebrating the tremendous contributions that Hispanic and Latino men and women have made throughout our Commonwealth and our country. Nearly 800,000 Virginians of Hispanic and Latino descent proudly call Virginia home, enhancing our communities with their vibrant culture and traditions. We must acknowledge that Hispanic and Latino history is Virginia history and recognize the foundation that Hispanic and Latino men and women have built in this country. And as we highlight your leadership in business and education, your service in our military, in our government, and in the fight against COVID-19, we must also acknowledge the disproportionate impact of the pandemic on our Hispanic and Latino communities. We will continue doing everything we can to ensure our most vulnerable populations have access to the healthcare, testing, and PPE that is needed to stay safe as we fight this virus. And we remain focused on ensuring that Hispanic and Latino Virginians are counted in the 2020 census. We also recognize the hard work and dedication of Hispanic and Latino community leaders, including members of the Virginia Latino Advisory Board who continue to advocate for justice and equality for all. Your voices are an important part of our administration and were central to the historic passage of the in-state tuition and driver's privilege cards for all immigrants, regardless of citizenship status earlier this year. America is a nation of immigrants and our communities are strengthened by hardworking individuals striving to create a better life for themselves and their children. This is the spirit that makes Virginia the best place to live, work, and raise a family. So as we celebrate the strength of our diversity, let us also unite in our efforts to build a more equitable, more welcoming, and more inclusive Commonwealth. 